This is a pocket hole jig system. It drills a shallow angled hole to semi-conceal a screw for fast, strong joints in timber. To use, measure the thickness of your timber and set that thickness on the drill guide using the scale on the side. Then position the stop collar so that the shoulder of the drill lines up with the same mark on the guide as well. The three holes in the jig give you a variety of options in terms of spacing. I suggest you always use two screws for maximum strength. Once the timber's in position, you can squeeze that adjustable clamp and it's locked in place, ready for drilling. And that dust extraction port not only keeps your bench clean, but it also sucks all the dust out of the hole as well. Once drilled, position both pieces of timber for your joint in place on a flat surface and use the included clamp to hold them together. The kit comes with a portable base for use on site or remotely away from your workbench. It also comes with a spacer block. Those spacer blocks attach to the bottom of the jig and can be stacked. They're used for repair applications like inside joinery and cabinetry. This support stop is also included. It can be screwed to your workbench and used to support longer lengths of timber. It also pivots up to be an adjustable stop for mass production. The kit comes with these two square drive tips. They fit the Craig screws specifically designed for this system. They're available on coarse and fine threads. We've got a nice large head. They fit precisely with the collar on that drill bit. They pull the two pieces together nice and tight. Available from Craig are some plugs that fit neatly into the hole to conceal your screws if you need to. They've included a couple of pine colored ones as well as a range of the screws in the kit for you to give them a crack. This is a really well designed, easy to use jig that gives you a great option for fast, strong, concealed joints in timber on your next project. If you got any questions about the K4 Master System from Craig, hit me up in that comment section below. And until next time, I'm Tim and you're watching Cine Tools TV.